In this video, we are going to go over the process of how to remove an oven door. The door in this video is specific to many higher-end ovens such as KitchenAid, Decor, Thermador, and Fisher & Paykel. There are various reasons why the oven door will need to be removed throughout the life of your oven. Hinges can become weak and need to be replaced, as well as debris falling down inside the door needing to be cleaned on the glass. This is presented to you by AppliancerepairLesson.com. The specific oven is a Fisher & Paykel wall oven, but again, the door removal process is similar on many higher end ovens. Open up the oven door and you can access the hinges. There is a locking tab that you can flip in the upright position to lock each side of the door hinge. The locking tab can look different on various models, but they all react the same way. With both locking tabs in the upright locked position, you can now remove the door. Lift the door at a 45 degree angle. Grab the door securely and wiggle it up and down slightly while pulling out. If you are replacing the hinges, the first step is to unlock each hinge. With a screwdriver in the palm of your hand, push down firmly on each door hinge. This will allow you to lower the locking tabs so that both hinges are in the closed position. In order to separate your door for both hinge removal and door cleaning, you will need to remove the screws along the bottom. This model has four screws going in through the bottom of the oven door. There are two screws going through the left hinge and two screws going through the right hinge. Fisher & Paykel has screws that go up along the left side of the door as well as screws that go up the right side of the door. These screws need to be removed so that the door can be separated. Some models will have screws across the top. As you can see, this Fisher & Paykel model does not. Once you have reassembled the door, you can now push the hinge down back into the locked position and flip the locking tab to lock both hinges. The door is now ready to be installed. Angle the door at a 45 degree angle and place the door hinges through the door receptacles. Open the door to the fully extended position and release the locking tabs. You have completed the job. For more video demonstrations as well as step-by-step -step tutorials, please go to AppliancerepairLesson.com. If you'd like to try one of our other support options such as forum support or live chat with a technician, just go to AppliancerepairLesson.com.